Hi guys, Charlie Matthews here, and in this video I'm going to show you how you can uninstall a program properly on your computer. Now, um, if you are into computers, then you should know how to uninstall a program on your computer. So, for example, if I wanted to get rid of CCleaner, which I don't actually need, I would just right click, then click uninstall. Okay, so, so you can find that um, and then delete it there and then delete it from your recycle bin which basically uninstalls it or you can type in down here uninstall a program add or remove programs there you can go onto your app and then you can uninstall it okay so you can click on there uninstall so if we were looking for ccleaner we will go down find the ccleaner and then uninstall it there but that would not delete any of the other files that are already um, with the program. So, for example, any files that, that you may have got from, um, for example, CCleaner, if it um, does a clean and then has all of the different files and um, residue almost after the uh, scan had taken place, like results from the scan or error codes or anything like that, it will delete them all because all of them added up does make a lot of space. <clears throat> So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go onto Chrome and I'm going to download a program called IOBit Uninstaller. Now, I really like um, IOBit products um, because they're very trustworthy and they work very well. So, you're going to type in IOBit Uninstaller on the top there. And then the first one that comes up, you're just going to click on there. And then it's the IOBit Uninstaller 7 free. So, you can click free download. And it supports Windows 10, 8.1, 8, 7, Vista, and XP. So let's do a free download. This will take you to softonic.com. Then we can do another free download there. And it will start downloading down here. So it's actually doing it there. Um, I'm just going to leave that to do it. It should be done any second. Um, so it has finished now. And then I'm going to open it up. So this will open this screen here. Uh, just say yes to any anything that pops up there. Um, give it permission to do things. It says thanks for downloading there. So we can close all of them. And then it comes here. Welcome to IOBit Uninstaller. Installer. So we're going to click install. You can also view the uh, EULE there. Um, and all of that, e EULA, sorry, and then the privacy policy, you can read all that if you really want to, but I know that they're trustworthy, select your language up there, uh, obviously mine's English, and then click install, uh, if it comes up um, like anything like this, I'm not going to have that, um, then just be aware of what you're downloading with it, so this shouldn't take a minute or two, and then once it has completed, then you can um, go ahead and uninstall the program that you want to. So we're just going to leave this going uh, for just a sec. And it should be finished in a minute. Okay, so it's done now. Uh, you can also subscribe to the IOBit newsletter and get a free gift. Um, but I don't really want to do that. So I'm going to click no thanks. And then it has finished. So please click fin finish to run it. So we're going to click finish. And this will open up IOBit 7.4. Now, I've actually already used this before, so it has Pro. Yours will probably say free. Um, but that doesn't really matter on there. That, that's all okay. Um, so, what we're going to do now is we are going to um, locate the C Cleaner. Now, you can either find it on there, or you can actually right-click on there, and then click Powerful Uninstall. But um, I'm just going to find it on here. So we're looking for C Cleaner, and I've found it there. So it's not really that big. It's 22.62 megabytes. But let's um, just delete that anyway. So we can click on there. Um, one program selected to uninstall. Then we can click uninstall. Now it comes here. Are, are you sure uh, you want to uninstall the selected program? Yes. Do not create a restore point. You don't really need to do that unless it's a really big file. Or automatically remove residual files. I'm just going to leave that off for now. So I'm just going to show you what it does. So click uninstall. And it will uninstall the CCleaner. It may open CCleaner. 
um, in order for it to actually uninstall. So just uninstall all these and then click finish. So that will have done any second and the icon's gone from down there. So that's gone um, and it says here. So you have successfully uninstalled one program with details below and all of them. And it doesn't actually look like any files are left. Okay, so if there were files left from that program, then, then it would come up there um, and it would also say delete the residual files, which your computer on the normal uninstall wouldn't do. So this basically is a great program for deleting any of the other files that you don't want, rather than just deleting the big program. So um, if you like this video, then please leave a like on this video and subscribe to my channel for more content. Also, while I'm here, please could you check out my um, website, which is charliematthews.co.uk. Okay, so this has all the information about me on it. Um, so we have um, about me there. Um, we have my contact. So if you want to get in contact with me, you can either leave a comment on this video if you have any questions or simply just contact me on there. There are links to my YouTube channel there, um, as you can see there. Also, guys, um, please could you check out my latest video, which was the head cam snooker match. Um, against my dad, which looks actually pretty cool on there, as I filmed it in 1080 at 60. Um, you can see it all on there. That that's just um pretty long video. Um, also, guys, sorry that you can't see some of my dad's shots on there, but never mind. Uh, you can see that one. Ooh, good pot there. So anyway, guys, uh, please check out my um website there. You can go onto my Instagram as well, which is charliemuk147. Uh, a lovely picture of Sean Murphy there. Um, so these are all linked down below in the description as well, so you don't have to type out all of that. Um, also, guys, please, would you please subscribe to my YouTube channel, as I'm going to be posting more regularly um, and with a lot more content to come. So thank you for watching this video, guys. Um, and I hope you have a good evening, morning or afternoon whenever you're watching this. So thank you for sticking with me and stay tuned for more content. So thank you and see you later.